Avocado toast, vegan eggs, vegan sausage, uh, breakfast potatoes. There's a church. It is Sunday. Don't forget about Jesus. brunch at the Line LA. It's the hotel we're staying at. It's wonderful. So aesthetic. Reasonably priced. Good location. Great customer service. The Line LA sponsor me. <laughs> So good, so good, so good. I am very satisfied. Got a lot of food. The portions were bigger than I expected, so it's okay. I'll finish it. It's blown away. So it's like a greenhouse. It's a greenhouse. It's an indoor outdoor brunch patio. It's beautiful. Okay, I'm gonna spill that one. I'm gonna spill that, so I'm not gonna I'm not gonna try to vlog and drink my mimosa. I just realized we're in LA. We can't we can't be ordering five things off the menu just for one person like how we can back at home. I just I ordered like five things and the the waitress was like okay. You done yet? <laughs> And I kept on ordering more and more. You know, I get excited to try different things and try new, new places. And I love food and you know, I'm vegan. So I want to try every single vegan option that they have. Usually they have like, here, over here, they have like five options. So that was good. I had to try every single option. My dress matches this aesthetic. Green, earthy, earth girl. Earth girl aesthetic. I'm feeling earthy today. That's gorgeous. I like those waters.
I'm guessing that might be Long Beach or something because there's a beach. You can literally see the ocean right there. And, and then you can see the West Hollywood buildings right over there. Where's the Hollywood sign at from here? The Hollywood sign is like right next to us, so it's not, I don't, maybe not, I don't know. It's really close to us, though. So. Okay. You could go hiking up there. Wow, <laughs> Now, when I get back to the hotel room, I'm gonna watch Griffith Obser Observatory Haunted Stories. <laughs> Scary stories. I love it. Cause this is like some kind of scariness. <laughs> but it's beautiful up here. It really truly is. It's a gorgeous, gorgeous piece of architecture. Gorgeous. I don't want to fall on the fall on the floor. Oh, that one's scary. What is that? In a museum. Summer solstice. The sun in the year. Scorpius. Hold on, I'm gonna finish. Cuando la luna se pone bien grandota, como una pelotota. Yeah, that's um, Abraham, Dr. Abraham Lincoln. I almost said that's Abraham Lincoln. It's Albert Einstein. It's my other employer, Jet Propulsion Laboratories. We're going to talk about that a little bit as well. Okay, guys, it's Albert Einstein. I'm going to zoom in just. She's talking to me. It's Albert Einstein, you guys. Yeah, I said it right there. July 20th is the 50th, was the 55th anniversary of the Apollo 11 moon landing, and it was a really huge deal because in 1958 we said, "Hey, we need to go to the moon." Have you seen Oppenheimer yet? In space, and by you'll like it. Oh, I liked it. People say it's boring, but I liked it. We had two people land on the moon. Africa, and then there's Italy. Saturn 5 
place in the solar system you explore both on surface and from space it's the only one you really could have <laughs> sorry this is where the grapevines at it's basically the grapevines of san andreas fault pretty much yep. Before our show begins, we would like to point out the exit that you may use. What's that green dot? That green dot is... Look at it, there's a green dot in there. It's an orb. It'll be a lot easier than walking up.